welcome back guys hope everyone is doing well today i am back again for you guys with a new topic of how you can install power bi in your windows 10 operating system machine or your laptop or your computer the steps are very really, very simple and clear so without the wastage of time let's move towards the installation you have to come to your search bar in your system you if you ever open microsoft store before it will be appear here i have recently open this that's why it is appearing here if it is not available in your pop up bar then you simply have to type store over here i haven't typed the store fully and the microsoft store will be appear you simply have to open it you can open it from here you can open it from here as well this is how microsoft store will be looks like the next step you simply have to type power bi in the search bar here it is you can see here power bi desktop has appear you have to click on this icon it will take a bit time and the interface will be available now you can read the descriptions here you can view the ratings and reviews for this tool and many more so i am going to just click on this get button available in my microsoft store click on this button it will take a bit time to get installed we can wait until this installation gets completed let's explore something yeah the size has been appeared it the total size of this power bi desktop tool is 744.1 mb and you can see the downloading has been done for 10% it will be completed in 3 or 4 minutes it depends upon your internet speed if you have a good internet it will be completed in little time if you have a slower speed it will take a bit time to get installed it is almost 20% Installed. It is only it is installed sixteen percent. It has approximate size of two point three GB. The release date for this tool is two thousand seventeen. One more important thing I forget to tell you guys. get this app while signed in to your microsoft account and install on up to 10 windows devices okay because i have already logged in my microsoft account in this microsoft store that's why it didn't ask 
for the sign up or the login to me if you guys don't have logged in or don't have the microsoft account you want to install power bi in simple steps you have to sign up for the microsoft account if you have already microsoft account you simply have to logged in that account in your system your machine in your, your windows and whenever you open the store it it didn't ask for the store for the next time i think you guys got this can check how it has been used downloaded you guys have a lot of options available here these are categorizing this additional information this tool is published by and you can see the supported languages here the download process has been completed and it take about 2 or 3 seconds to install now you can open it from here or you can search the power bi from search bar as well it it will be named as power bi desktop we can open it from the store as well and the next time whenever we open this we can open from here or we can easily create the shortcut on the desktop as well This is how the Power BI interface or the GUI looks like. These are the simple steps you have. You can be able to install the Power BI. So the next step is what Power BI Desktop and Power BI Service work together, sign in to enhance your collaboration and access organizational content. You simply have to sign in with your Microsoft account and you can be able to use Power BI Desktop. Hope you guys understood the installation scenario very well. Steps are very simple. Please like and subscribe my channel and share my channel with your colleagues. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. Stay blessed.